This is my latest update here. If you look right in front of you here, I've got my crystals all ready. I've got this lit wire which I wound with my drill. Just a long string of wire, double over and twist it with drill and I've got a lit wire. What they call a lit wire in there. The crystals are secured at each end by a bit of epoxy. So these are going to go in my wishing machine design here. And there's my amethyst one and there's a smoky quartz at the end there. Okay, you can see the, the crystals the way I've done them all. Right, here's my my um, wishing machine. I've panelled up the inside boards. And there's a bit of wood fill in there for a little tiny bit of gaps here. Yeah? And see the panel, so you cannot see the frame now. Cannot see the frame. See, so it's all done now. So what I'll do is I'll glue one crystal here. Run the wires to there, another one up here, and run the wires to that one there, and so on there. And these are the plates up here. These, this is the front of the wishing machine design. I've got the brass plate fitted. It's not the same fit, this is not two millimeters thick like I ordered, but um, it'll do in here. But it is the right size. So that's all fitted, it's nice and it's shined up. And all that there, so it's my wishing machine. So I'm getting there. Um, a couple of minutes before midnight, while I was laying in bed awake, thinking about all the wishes I can make with this and what experiments I like to do when I finish this off, um, um, a mysterious light appeared in my room here. It lit up my desk area here. I sat up a little bit, my head up a little bit, and I looked towards the end of my bed and I said, what the hell is that? And there I was looking at a, a round light that appeared at the end of my bed. It just disappeared after I watched it for a few seconds in here. It's funny, eh? Just after I've been thinking about what I can do in my wishing machine, all the wishes I can make of it, that appeared. So anyhow, that's the latest update for now. And thank you for watching.